to my channel. In case you are new here, my channel focuses on fashion, travel, beauty, and overall black girl magic, luxury, leisure, lifestyle. In today's video, I am doing a Zara haul and I'm gonna style some of the pieces I got from Zara. I'm super excited, of course. I'm always super excited <laughs> about some of the things I picked up from Zara. I missed some of the sale, but some of the items I did get on sale and some of the items I am just drooling over. You know, sometimes Zara is hit or miss, and sometimes their pieces um, don't always fit me, but I have learned my lesson, and I do try to stick to like tops and coats and things that I know are a little bit more universally forgiving. So I did pick up a few things from Zara. I wanted to share those things with you because I know with Zara, it's all about time to make sure you can also access some of those things. So why don't we get into the video? Before we like get fully, fully into the haul and I'm gonna try everything on, I'm gonna be standing up and all the things. I wanted to let you know about this purple like jacket I got. I got this from And Other Stories. I love And Other Stories. They really, I feel like they really make some good like classic pieces that are pretty affordable. They're in the same price point in same range as Zara. Um, this is like a shorter little like jacket. Um, again, it's like lavender, it's like light purple and I really like it. It's comfortable, so I'm really enjoying it. Go ahead and subscribe, go ahead and like, and make sure you hit the bell notification so that you never miss an upload from me. Let's get into the Zara haul. Okay, let's get into the Zara haul. Um, this is not from Zara, this is actually from Amazon. This top is from Amazon, and these pants are from my Amazon The Drop collection, yes. So y'all let me know below if you want me to do like a YouTube video styling these. I may do like some quick ones on um, Instagram. If you're not following me on Instagram, you should be following me on Instagram because I like to do like 15 second reels, you know, just to style things and give people like quick ideas. And they're also like easy to save, so I like to do that. But let me know if y'all wanna see that on YouTube. But let me show you what I would pair this with that I got from Zara. So I got this beautiful black coat from Zara. And I know you're like, Tanika, you got a black coat? Yes, I do have like a black Prada coat that y'all have probably never seen. And a big black puffer like Canada Goose Coat because I'm a New Yorker and every New Yorker has a black puffer. And so I ended up getting this, it's more of a dress coat. I did have a black coat before, but I never wore it. But I feel like it's nowhere near as like, you know, razzly as this. I mean, I already know. I already can feel y'all gagging because that is how cute this coat is. And, and I've worn the coat, if you follow me on TikTok, okay? I have worn this coat so many times on TikTok because I wore it to Miami. I got it like right before I went to Miami. I ordered it online. I got it in a size medium. It's pretty true to size. I'm 5'3", allegedly, okay? The allegation states I'm 5'3". Um, and it cuts like a little, maybe like, I don't know, four or five inches below the knee for me. So it is, you know, it's, it goes to my calf. So it is pretty much a um, full length coat for me. I really like it, it's super cute. Again, it's wool, it has a little like faux fur collar, you know, I love it. And it looks, so luxe. There's no way you can tell this is from Zara and it just looks so, so luxe. And I would pair this with these pants because I love the like jewel tone magenta of these pants paired with like the fur texture and the coat and the like satin top. I just love the satin underneath. Now, if I were going out, I would pair like this with leggings and especially in New York City because it's super cold and I might run, may run in and run out. I may do like some fur. Ooh, I, that would be cute to have some fur earmuffs with this. Mm -hmm, I can totally see it. I would also, I would pair this like with my classic Chanel and these like black booties that I got from TJ Maxx. Let me put this stuff all on so you can see it together and get into the vibe.
on like a little heat protectant or like heat um, tank top from Uniqlo, which is like a New York City staple. Y'all let me know if y'all want to do like a chic, me to do like a winter chic, like how to look cute in the winter time, like with all the bulky clothes, you know what I'm saying? But also because, um, you know, I live in the thick of winter. Like uh, it is a proper winter in New York City. It is like 20 degrees, okay? And so y'all let me know if y'all want to see that. Um, but yeah, this is the look. This is the vibe. I love it with the bag. I think it's super cute. I love a little chain sticking out here, okay? I love that, you know, you have the beautiful magenta and it is like jewel toned and you have this like black at the top pulling it all together and I just love it. I love that you can add dimension with like texture to your outfit and this coat from Zara is to die. I love it, love. Okay, next up on the list is this beautiful oversized asymmetrical magenta fuchsia blazer. Obsessed, love it, got it on sale, adore it. I paired it with a satin shirt. I have so many satin shirts. My favorite satin shirt, y'all know, is from Aritzia. And I have a number of them. This one is actually from Amazon, Amazon um, staples, like the drop staples. And then these tights are from Fendi. If you saw my luxury haul, you would have seen these tights. And these boots are from TJ Maxx. And I would probably pair it with like my black um, Chanel classic flap or um, my Dior. And if you follow me on TikTok, you will have seen this or um, Instagram, you will have seen this as one of my like winter outfit of the days. I am obsessed. Obsessed. I think it's so, 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 so cute. I cannot wait to wear this for a date night. It is so cute. Adore, love, 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 love. Okay, so next up on my list is this big old oversized sweater from Zara. It's like a periwinkle, light blue. Love, 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 love. I just paired it really casually with like some Spanx leatherette tights and they have a little bit of texture to them. I paired them with these Charles and Keith flat boots. They're like flat ankle boots. They have a little gold detail. Ooh. I'm falling. <laughs> they have a little gold detail, um, really cute flat boots. And then I would just pair it with this oversized Loewe um, scarf. Y'all, uh, if y'all watched my luxury haul video, y'all would have seen that I got this um, Loewe scarf. And I think just like double knotting it, you know, sporting it like that. It's just really cute. I think it's a, such a casual like running out look. I probably would wear the black coat that I hauled from Zara and just take the fur neck off and then just wear it as like a long peacoat. I could also wear this with my black puffer and a black bag and just be on my way. I could also wear this with like my periwinkle big old Birkin, like the Birkin 35 and just like wear this shopping. This is what I wore to the airport. This is exactly what I wore to the airport. And I wore the black coat with it. And I wore my black Birkin or my black Birkin. I wore my periwinkle Birkin. So yeah, that is what I wore and I love it. It's super comfy. It's oversized. I had like my Dior bralette underneath just in case I like tipped over. I didn't want the goods to be out. And I think this is such a good, just like cute staple. I like that Zara comes out with like these good knits. And so I had to pick this up. I love this color. Um, I know some of you, if you watch my luxury haul, you're probably like, is that the same kind of or color sweater as the Loewe? It is not, okay? It is not. It is not the same color. The devil's in the details. Don't play me, okay? But love it. Love this sweater. <laughs>
tweed, black and white blazer. It's giving you all the Chanel vibes. I paired this with my New York and Company like Gabriel Union um, turtleneck. This was gifted to me by the brand. I also love these mango green like split kind of boot cut pants. I love that just like Bottega green that everyone's doing now and I just paired it with my black Chanel bag. I'm trying to get more use out of the classic um, flap but this is the outfit and I think it's totally great for like office, a meeting. I would wear this to brunch because I'm in my 30s and I feel like I can get away with that. And yeah, I think you could also pair this with some jeans and this turtleneck. You could also go for like a black turtleneck. I would wear this with like white pants. I probably wouldn't do it in like New York City winter, but I would definitely do it in New York City fall. I think you could pair like this with a dress underneath, maybe a shorter dress, maybe a pop of color. I could totally see magenta with this. And I think it is perfect. I love to pair black and white with green. I think it is, it's just great. I mean, a lot of people pair black and white with red. It's just like, we get it, very cliche. Um, I think it still works. I think, especially with like a pop of red on the lip. And I think this is a perfect, just like winter pull together look. And it is all thanks to this blazer from Zara. I mean, you take the blazer off and it's not really as cute and chic. I think the blazer adds the touch of brilliance to this outfit. I love it. I wish the buttons were a little like more sturdy, but again, I got this on sale, so you can't, you know, you can't beat it. You can't beat it. I think it's such a, such a cute look. Y'all let me know in the comments what y'all think about this blazer. I got this in a small. I was a little worried because I like a little bit more room in my arms, especially with the lining, but this worked out great. <laughs> sleeveless um, piece from Zara and I believe this was also on sale I got it because it reminded me of like the Bottega turquoise teal ish colors that they've been coming out with as of late and I wanted to pair it with my Bottega pants but they actually didn't match so I paired it with these pants from Rebecca Minkoff which they gifted to me during New York Fashion Week um, the last year fashion week and these aldo boots the chocolate boots i don't know if you can see these boots but love these boots and um the only thing i don't like about this is it it like hits at the most like the widest part of my waist and that's the only thing or the widest part of my body which is my hips and it's still chunky up here so it kind of gives me this shape that i do not think is really flattering on me but i would pair this with a blazer um, so like a monochromatic look underneath and then like this very bright pop of color. I love the idea of like teal and brown or teal and like deep tan and camel. I love those like shades together. And I would just also pair it with my brown little Jacquemus bag. So let me get that and um, show you. So yeah, this is how I would pair it. I would probably um like scrunch up the sleeves to add to create some kind of balance right because this is oversized and this is oversized and i would have like the little bag and i think that's cute for a just like winter evening where everybody's going to be in bulky clothes everybody's probably going to be in some neutral color palette this is a way to be neutral with like a really big statement piece of color and i love it i think it's totally cute for the price point I could see myself rocking this more than a few seasons. I think that even though this 
like knit fringe is trending, I think it will last a couple of seasons. So I really enjoy this. that Zara haul and Zara like style video. I do like to see what other people got from Zara. I do love to see when they try it on, but I also like to see when they style it. And so I wanted to make sure I styled those pieces for you to see how I would wear them in real life. And I'm happy with all my purchases. I think if I stay away from bottoms from Zara, I will be safe. I think if I stay away from bottoms from Zara I will be safe and so that is the category that I'm going to try to try to stick to at all right go ahead and comment go ahead and like also hit the subscribe button and hit the bell notification so that you never miss an upload from me I will see you in the next video bye